What, what, what the hell? What's going on with my game? Is he holding nuts? It's kind of gay. Anyway, ah, greetings mortals. I am Shadow, the ultimate life form, and welcome to a brand new video. Now today we're gonna be trying out it. There's a video of this? The hell's going on? Oh, that's so scary! I can't believe how scary- So what's this video supposed to signify? Some sort of weird low resolution version of the game? Because that's what I'm getting from this mod so far. Okay, let's see what all this is building up to. I'm pretty sure it's gonna move up to something spooky. Okay, so someone just put a random dark filter over everything. Doesn't even look that scary. Oh, everything's getting darker. That, 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 that completely changes the whole game. And now we can't see anything anymore. <laughs> oh, 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 this is like some sitcom intro. It's like some anime intro. You know, you got like the images in the background going everything like, oh. <laughs> what is this? Wait, so the bosses are the blue hedgehog? Okay, we got Tails not exe in this mod too, apparently. Okay, as much of an idiot as ever. He's just normal Tails, but completely black with pale. Knuckles exe as well. All right then. So this mod is the whole package then. Why does Mighty Cratch that? Oh, that's supposed to be his exe fault. He's just completely. This is completely black. There's there's nothing different about. And Ray looks like a flying poop. He just looks like a giant floating poop with a head. How am I supposed to be scared of this? Tails doll! Alright, Eggman looks completely normal like usual. But I expected that. So we're trying to take down Eggman this time. This mod has everything and has an anime opening and everything. That makes it so much more moi. Muy bueno. Okay. Dramatic. This is the entire mod, ladies and gentlemen. Just this intro segment. Watch it turn to side.exe. Is that it? Sonic.exe Mini Abyss. What a horrifying experience, everyone. But anyway, like I said, today I'm going to be playing the Sonic.exe mod, otherwise, the Sonic Mania mod, otherwise known as Sonic.exe Mania Abyss. So today we're going to be playing that today on the channel. I had no idea the intro segment was going to be this long, but basically, this is a mod that completely changes Sonic Mania into a Sonic.exe style game. So if you guys do enjoy, Shadow plays Sonic.exe Mania. Subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications, and leave the comments below. What video you want me to re uh, do the next? Give this video for 1,000 likes if you want to see more. And as always, please enjoy the video. And if you guys want me to play any more Sonic Mania mods, which I'm bringing back, by the way, let me know in the comments below, and I'll play them. Okay, and it just completely goes back to the title screen. Bro! All right, now we're going to be trying Mania mode for this one, or to test out what's so different. So we have two options here. So we have Sonic.exe and Tails.exe. We have Ray.exe. Looks like an idiot. And then we have... Mighty.exe, okay, okay, this is totally scary. If you guys want to play the mod for yourself, I'll leave a link to the description below. Then we have Knuckles.exe, and then we have Sonic.exe. You know how about we try the dynamic duo first and see? Okay, so the music's completely different. So it's not just a reskin then. Okay, so Sonic.exe flies in the animations. Ooh, the music kind of slaps. So is this some sort of new remix version, or is this just something that was created just for the game? It seems like this mod has a lot put into it. Even the it like the menu system is different. Okay, obviously we have the Phantom Ruby there from the original storyline. All right, let's try this out and see what makes this mod so different. Let's see if they added a homing attack or any other new areas. I was kind of hoping that Green Hill Zone would be changed to the Green Hill Zone. For, oh, it is different. Okay, so Green Hill Zone looks completely different. Good to know. Wait, oh, why is there a little bit of a glitch when Sonic.exe jumps? Is that supposed to be on purpose? Okay, so looks like a lot of the effects are the same. The background's the same. What about the motor bugs? Is that all the same? They're slightly different, I believe. They have different lighting on them. Okay, good to know that this mod isn't just a complete reskin. There are a few other things added into this. So according to the intro segment, I guess... 
the egg, uh, Eggman has been replaced by the Blue Hedgehog this time. I mean, it sort of makes sense, but I feel like it would have been a lot more appropriate if you had the bosses be like, I don't know, Tails and Knuckles. Considering the Sonic.exe game has a lot of them, Sonic.exe taking a lot of them down. Alright, let's go up here. And we're just gonna go, I swear to God, if I hit those spikes, it was gonna be the end of the game. Okay, I want to see the ending bit. That's the part I'm most curious about. I want to see if that's any different. Oh, you're gonna be kidding. Oh, the sound effects are different. Okay. Okay, no, it doesn't matter. As long as we have a few rings, that's all that matters. Okay, so I'm gonna have to reach the end here. And then we can see what else is going on with this mod. I'm curious to try out the Sonic.exe and Tails, uh, like, basically the Knuckles.exe segments. Okay, so these segments haven't changed at all, so they're completely useless. Get out of here! Oh, the menu system is different. Well, at least there's something visually to look at. Alright, get me out of the special stage. I want to try everything else. I want to have a look at Knuckles.exe, Ray.exe, and all the others. Alright, I want to fight the boss this time. I want to see what Eggman looks like. Okay. And then we're just going to go through down here. Okay. We're going to use the good shield down here and fly through the air. There's multiple Sonic Mania mods I've been willing to try out for a while, actually. Oh, wait. I just realized. The background isn't even blood. That's poop color. The background's just poop. Okay, hit that thing. Hit the flying balls. It's coming down to us in the face. It's not Pride Month anymore, bro! Okay, oh my god. I was about to say, if I lost to the first boss of this game, I was gonna lose it. Alright, so far, so good. We were able to defeat the first guy, no problem. Alright, so even the little ring bit at the end is Sonic.exe. And the animations are different. So it blinks, and Tails.exe looks at us while Sonic.exe pretends to look cool. Who finds Sonic.exe actually scary? Oh man, a Sonic.exe mod makes Sonic Mania so scary now. Totally doesn't make it even more of a loserish game. Okay, I'm just gonna move up here and then move around these rings area because I really just want to see what it's like to fight the blue eye truck in the very ending segments. Okay, go through that. So the Death Egg Robot will have to be something that the blue eye truck operates then. What is that supposed to imply? Okay, so let's see if any of these stages are different. The music's different! Okay. So what I could gather from the mod so far, the difference being that everyone's been completely reskinned while also having poop water while also having the music different. You know what? That's better than most mods I've tried out. The last Sonic Mania mod I tried out was Amy, Amy XL, and that was, that was horrifying. I, I, I hate the look of Amy XL. Like, who has a thing for Fat Amy? Oh my god, people at the internet are weird. Okay, gotta move down here. Okay, destroy that wall, the hidden wall over there, and zoom past the stages. Because we have sort of similar to our homing a chat. The motorbug of the tree completely ruined it. Oh my god, you're gonna be kidding me. You know what would be interesting? If someone made a shadow mod for Sonic Mania. I'm pretty sure there's one that exists. If you guys want me to play that, let me go. I really got hit by those wooden spikes. You gotta be kidding me. Those weren't even there. Okay. So just gotta move around here. And move down this mud water. And then go to the spray. Boom! Okay, finally. Are we near the end of the stage? I want to see what the Eggman segment is like. Okay, so it's the blue hedgehog that's in there. Interesting. Alright, now here's a trick to defeating this boss. All you have to do is go behind him. And then just do this. And it allows us to just go straight into him, like nothing. There you go! And we just defeated the boss that easily! Take that stupid blue eye truck! I wonder who we save then. Do we save the motorbox? Like, who do we save from these little canisters? I wonder what's different. Nothing! Yo, what? that's very appropriate! Okay, well, so far, I'm very impressed with this mod. And the Sonic logo is covered in blood. Okay, I didn't notice that before. Alright, good to know that this game isn't just a quick rehash. Alright, let's see this little cutscenes here. Isn't these guys a little different? Like, the King one's new, isn't he? Alright, and the Blue Eye Truck gets away, of course, by using the Phantom Ruby like an idiot. Alright, well, I feel like we've had enough of this segment per- Oh, God, Chemical Plant Zone. Oh, the chemicals this time are green, so that's completely different. And what about the music? Okay. You all have to say, I'm a really huge fan of the music segments of this game. They did a good job remixing the soundtracks and everything to make it sound more extravagant. Okay, go to the end here. It's weird. It's ex it's unusual seeing Sonic.exe actually fly instead of run. But I guess because of his idiocy, he would prefer to fly over all this. I hope me playing this mod doesn't awaken Sonic.exe or anything. The last time I played a Sonic.exe game, it meant horrors for our YouTube channels. Oh my god. Okay, gotta get through. Well, they look good to know that Chemical Blind Zone isn't nearly just as annoying as it is compared to the other games. I mean, if Sonic.exe drowns, is that really a bad thing? I mean, let's be honest here. Sonic.exe is one of the most annoying people alive. People believe he's scary. I don't believe he's scary at all. I believe he's an absolute idiot. Wait, I'm curious. Would the drowning music be completely different at all? Or would that be the same? Because I'd argue that the actual, like, you know, anxiety soundtrack is actually just as good. 
I got hit by more blue ball. Okay, fine then. Fine. We're just gonna go through these hoops and ignore everything that just happened. I swear to God. These platforms fall. Oh, and he fades away when he gets hit out. Okay, you know what? I'm done. I'm done with this area. I'm done. I'm done with the EXE segment of this level. I'm curious to try out the other EXEs. How about we try Knuckles.exe? Since that's one of the EXEs that actually matters. Let's try Knuckles.exe. Let's see what his segment looks like. You know, I'm curious about the designs for Knuckles.exe, because they look completely different from the EXEs we know. There's no blood gushing from their eyes, for example. And Snucklesnut.exe still gets hit the same way as he did in the previous playthrough. Alright, sounds completely reasonable to me. Okay, let's see. And now, is the, is the water gonna turn into poop water? It just turns to poop water. Now, here's the thing. I would applaud the creators of this mod for making a blood background, which nor is the time I would. But this is just brown liquid on blue water. Don't you know how sus that- It looks like just someone just pooped in the water. Someone pooped in the water. And that's not not good at all. Okay, so we destroyed that because of the Red Echidna. Alright, so, to be fair, we've actually never met Red Echidna.exe. We know he exists. Right, so the Red Echidna can climb up the walls. I forgot about that. Well, to be fair, we never actually met Knuckles.exe. But knowing the actual real Red Echidna, he wouldn't be any better. Okay, we could still do the Spin Dash at least. But there are no extra moves added, which I thought there would be, considering that the... Oh, we got hit by that! Oh my god, you know what, I'm just gonna go... I swear to god. I swear to god, if that was the end of the stage, I was actually gonna quit. Okay, we fly up here. And the music seems creepy but ominous. I feel like it perfectly fits the Sonic.exe aesthetic. Okay, destroy this thing. Okay, destroy this thing. Alright, we got the ring from there. Go down here. And we submerge in the poop water! Fantastic! I feel like the mod could have benefited more from maybe a reddish sort of background. I feel like that would have been better. Right, let's see if the aura effects are different. Alright, how about this? Nope, it's still the exact same. Exact same lighting effect. Okay, gotta go through these hoops. Right, it attracts the rings. It's been a while since I played Sonic Mania. I completely forgot about a lot of these things. Okay, move up here! Oh, we gotta explore more of this mod. Okay, let's climb up this little rampy thing. Oh man, that caught me off guard. I thought that pillow was gonna crush me for a second. The, the motorbunk! Oh, screw you too, motorbunk! Alright, just gonna fly across this little canyon area. And then move up here. And then move smoosh! Okay, come on. How far are we going? How far are we going? I swear to God, if we get hit by the spikes. Come on, don't stop. How are we not at the end of the stage yet? Come on, I want to finish this already. Okay, just gotta move through these rings. Through this little... Okay, well, we already know the special stages are completely different. Oh, God, I forgot how much slower these levels are when you play as the Reddit Kirna. This is so boring! Okay, can we climb up here? We can't climb up there. Oh, my God. So we have to go all the way down here! See, this is the problem when you don't play as the Blue Hedgehog. At least when you play as the Blue Hedgehog. You get to the stages a lot quicker. But now when he plays the Red Echidna, you have to go to these stupid slow stages. Out of this boss, we're gonna call it quits for this mod. Okay. Come on, just slap these balls in the face. Come on, the Red Echidna knows how to deal with these sort of things. He deals with it on a daily basis, especially with these flirts with me and Silver all the time, which is incredibly gay. Come on, destroy this thing. Are you kidding me? That actually hit me! Oh my god. Okay, so the Invincibility Flames actually helped me with that one. Did I say Invincibility Flames? Oh my god. Oh my god, these balls will stop flying at me! Okay. Oh my god. Okay, fly that. Fly down there. Let's go! All of them are destroyed. Alright, anyway guys, that was the mod SonicMania.exe or Sonic.exe Mania Abyss. If you guys enjoyed my playthrough of this mod and you want to see more of this mod, subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications, leave the comments below what you want me to do next. Gonna see for 1,000 likes if you want to see more. And tell me what mods you want me to try out next. Anyway, as always, this is the Ultimate Life from Shadow, signing out. And I'll see you all next time.